I'm Phyllis. I live in my van. Welcome to Moon Landing 3. I'm at Moon Landing 3 here with my two new friends. <laughs> so hey. say hi. <laughs> Introduce yourself. Uh, my name is Michaelin and this is my very first festival of any type such You've as never this. Been to any kind of meetup. I have never been to any meetup whatsoever. Are you uh, excited? Yes, but I mean, one of the reasons I'm doing it is because um, I always try to push myself. If something makes me a little scared, to go ahead and then do it's it. That's the thing to do. <laughs> I love that attitude. I love that attitude. <laughs> getting into the whole van life and, and yeah. RV camping and so we saw this and thought it'd be a great opportunity to kind of learn uh, make and friends, make some friends. And Absolutely, yeah. meetups are great for that. Yeah. yeah. Well, welcome. Thanks for being here and thanks for being on my channel. Oh, uh, thank you. Say like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. <laughs> <Bye>. <laughs> Yes, we have a backpack kitty. His name is. Oh Steve. my gosh! Wait, hold still for a sec. Oh my goodness! Adventure kitty! He is a rescue. You are adventure kitty. Thank you. You can turn <laughs> That's awesome. Thanks so, so much for talking. Yeah. About it. Wait, Put your hands wait, up and wait, wave wait to the camera. Yeah, hands up, hand up, hearts. Wait, wait. wait. Yeah. 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 Okay, I got your face. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. 
So tell us about wait, what kind of what kind of van is it? What year is it? Oh, uh, so this is a 2002 Chevy Express 3500. Nice. Uh, long wheelbase. That's a really long one. Yeah. That's <laughs> longer than mine. 155 maybe. This is a 8x8 awning. Got oh, the max nice. van. There's 300 watts of solar on the roof. Nice. Over here is a uh so back over here, I have a, um, I don't know if you can see it. There's a pure sine wave inverter, 1500 watts, nice. 190 amp AGM, like a commercial grade battery. Yeah. So you don't have here, to give the whole tour. I just wanted to uh, peek inside. Yeah. Uh, we have, if you stick your head in, you can see there's, I made bunk beds. There's a sink that drains out. Oh, look at that. There's the cassette toilet that separates. Yeah. Um, up here, the kids have TVs. Nice. So these are all electric blankets. So we all have electric blankets when it's cold. I love my electric yeah, blanket. My electric oh. blanket. Over here, I installed a uh, exterior port if I ever get shore power. Oh, nice. And then this is the drain that comes out. So I, nice. I built the whole thing out myself. I'm impressed. Hang it's on. beautiful. Hang on. Keep and on. comfortable. So Very comfortable. Comfortable. So. You can just talk to the camera. Hi, Tim. Tell, tell them what your wait, names are. Wait. My name is Grant and uh. How old are you? He's uh, stinky. Nine. And he's stinky. All boys are stinky. How old are you? I don't. I don't approve. He's don't nine know. and he's in fourth grade, and I'm and I'm seven. And old. he's a dooty dooty. <laughs> Hold that. Okay. Wait, no, you, don't trust her. No, she, don't, she could, don't. She could, she could, she could. Okay, put the camera. Can you see me in the camera? Yes. Ah, uh, this is Phyllis. Hello, my tribe. How are you? I'm leave her alone. I'm, I'm at Moon ready. Landing Three, and my new friend is holding my camera. Thank you so much. And we're having a great time, right? That's why I'm doing another one. Um, so, so I'll just put myself down for something. Talking about planning the year. Zen experience that she can create <laughs> while doing a hand poke tattoo is just absolutely amazing. Really? Um, yeah, <laughs> and um, I'll show you the one she. Oh, was awesome! January. January. Yeah. It's Schooly Palooza. And I think. Oh my gosh! She I did was, that? Yes. She did. <laughs> Wow, with with the poke, yeah, single, single needle. Poke. Yeah. Wow. And sorry, that's that's a technical term. The there's, so, there's, yes, she poked me. Yeah, I, I did. Um, but I in think a good that way. I think that more in than in a way that you're happy with it. Yes, I, I, absolutely, hundred percent. She signed up for this. I did, and I and I would like to say for your channel and all your viewers that if you get a chance to be poked ink by Abby do it because it's so much more than just getting ink she creates an experience. experience in that little tent that is not matched by anything else I have lots of ink obviously and I've got my back um, all done with a machine but right the it's atmosphere is a different whole different vibe whole different vibe and I well, love every minute wonderful. of it and I, I loved it so much I'm doing it again <laughs> And tell us your name again. Abigail. I am Ink by Abby on Instagram. Ink by Abby. Yeah. Great. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. Hi, Phyllis. <laughs> Hi. Hi. How's it going? Thank you. This looks awesome. Yeah, tell us about what kitchen. you got going on here. Yeah. So my husband, Andy, wrote a cookbook. It's called The Bus Life Kitchen. It's for two burners, stove tops, no oven required. That so is a great idea. Yeah. Tiny kitchen People cooking. People don't think they can cook in their vans, but you totally can. You can cook amazing things. That's that's Man. wonderful. Yeah, so you can check it out, thebuslifekitchen.com. And then I make jewelry, just for fun. That is a great idea. <laughs> and you've got some pretty jewelry Thank here. Thank you. Yeah, all flowers we found along the way. And I do the silversmithing, so. I see a little baby in there. Yes, old girl Tori. Nice schoolie. Thank you. How long have you been living in it? Well, or do you not? Four years. Wow, that's in awesome. In a few days, yeah. That's awesome. Well, thank you so much. Thank you. I hope you have a good moon landing. Thank you. All right, my darlings. One of the three of us is really, really, really super high. <laughs> really? I wonder which one of us that is. No phone, no food, no pets. I ain't got no cigarettes. I'm a
You're probably ready to hear me stop talking because I talked for a half an hour before we even started. I forget how loud I am and I forget that I'm like really weird until I see people's reactions. Oh. <laughs> I'm like, oh yeah. So you can close your eyes, take some deep breaths. We're just going to smudge you with a little sage that I, wild sage that I harvested. Take some deep breaths. I can feel that in my head. Did you feel it? But that's where I have a lot of pain. It was like they were vibrating. It's uh That was weird. Yeah, it like goes into where you need to like shake it out. I, I could feel know? it in my head. Wow. That's like the sound healing. Oh my gosh. So that's like kind of a reset our energy, put some Zen energy into that tattoo. Oh my gosh. Right, you ready? Mm -hmm. I hope so. It's gonna, it's nice and gentle. As gentle as a tattoo can be, that's what this is. Okay, here we go. First pokes, how's it feeling? Okay. Manageable. Yeah. <laughs> see what it feels like. You're doing great. Some spots are... Some spots will hurt more than yeah. others. Yeah.
lanterns in the dark? Are we, are we ghostly? Hello, my tribe. It's a little after one in the morning. You can still hear the music playing. I had a great night. Unfortunately, I didn't have someone videotaping me and my costume for tonight. It was, uh, the theme was Space Cowboy. And I'm going to show you at least a picture of my belly. Um, <laughs> so my costume was kind of weird. I took a piece of my body that was weird and I turned it into part of my outfit. Maybe I could show you a close up, but <laughs> this says, touch my alien baby. So that was part of my outfit. And actually, I'm going to go ahead and tell you about it. I had lap band surgery and the port that goes to my lap band is right there. And it actually, it sutured to the muscle where it was. And part of it ripped. It, actually, the sutures ripped out of this muscle and it felt about like you couldn't expect that to feel. So now it's like, it sticks out a little bit. It's, it moves around and um, I won't be able to use it anymore because now it's like standing on its end. But so I went around and I would shine the lantern on my stomach and get people to touch my alien baby. <laughs> so unfortunately, I don't have any of that on film, but it was super fun. And I've got lots of other great stuff that other people did awesomely tonight. I should show you real quick. Um, this is an indication of how busy I've been here and how much fun I've been having. My van has never been this messy before, ever. I'm going to show you just how messy my van is right now. Like There's dirty dishes in the sink. Counter, some food, tools. George was helping me with a project. I thought I was going to use my phone for this video. There's my little poor baby. I think that was the longest I've ever left him alone in my van. It was like two hours, and he was not happy with me. Look, that drawer is open. There's my. And then look at my bed. Rifling through stuff, trying to put this outfit together. So my bed is just covered in stuff. I hope y'all enjoy, enjoy watching it sort of being with me. And I love all y'all. Good night. Oh my gosh, I gotta go to bed. I gotta eat something really hot.